challenge is to get kids from iJustine, so let's go! Come on, Ed! Come on! my challenge and my challenge is to get you to give me a kiss so oh. we've, we've got three choices okay okay we've got the bronze okay the, the silver what? the bronze like kind of like a bronze medal oh. okay so we've got a bronze medal silver and we got gold so <laughs> it's up to you how much of an olympian you feel you are <laughs> That is amazing, he's my bro, he's my bro. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Cheers. Hi, we set us off for those video guys, and I'm with two very big Doctor Who fans, is that right? That is yes. correct. Yes. Guys, your favorite Doctor Who? Oh man, it's tough. I'm really enjoying the current Doctor, I am, but it's hard not to go for David Tennant. I think like a lot of people feel that way though, and it's kind of cliche, but. I'll, and I'll, I'll go with just current Doctor. I love the current Doctor, I think he's doing a great job, and I know that, I mean, we have such a comment battle going on in the video, and people are really, like, they get mad at each other, like full out, passionate, and I think, I guess that's a good thing, like people really believing in their Doctor defeating the other doctors like who would win the match I guess that's geekdom in general people love to discuss who is best and will die to, to like fight for that Absolutely. yeah <laughs> well we do a Doctor Who weekly live talk show oh my God. and so there's a lot of debate about you know who's everyone's favorite but uh, we really enjoyed your video that you guys did Thank you. how much research did you do in the pr in the old the old classic doctors you know, it was it was a lot of research. Uh, also, like we had some help with BBC because yeah. uh, it was done in partnership with them. So it was, it was so cool to actually like because we've done stuff like this before, but to actually like officially be doing it with the Doctor Who people with the BBC was like such an honor of like actually being able to be in touch with them and make sure we were getting things and make right. Sure we made no mistakes. They kind of helped us make sure we didn't mess up. If you mess things up online, like oh my God, how upset! Yeah. Especially like something like Doctor Who, like Whovians will kill you. And I, I don't know how if we really... I think we mostly were okay. I saw, I think there was some Something. debate over maybe one part of it that was not, a, was sort of right. I don't remember well, which part it was. about the of a, a unit, like what that was officially uh, is, uh, United, stands for. United. Stuff like that. Right, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You mean join the current series? Yes, definitely been enjoying it. Yeah, it's been it's been awesome. Uh, I, I think that even in America, what's been cool is I think that that whole campaign that a lot of YouTubers were helping and promoting. Like I think that, and when we went to Comic Con this year, it's amazing seeing just as much like Star Wars cosplay and everything. Doctor Who is everywhere now, and other years it wasn't. So I think that in America, people are finally starting to embrace it too, which is just so cool because obviously, like it's been something well, nothing, so huge. Nothing here. in America really gets made this like Doctor Who, and no. it should be. So it's great that it's becoming successful. Yeah. Well, thanks a lot, guys. Oh, thank you so thank much. Thank you so much. It's so cool that you came out. Really appreciate it. Hi, this is Alazar from those video guys, and I'm here with Joe Pena, the mystery guitar man himself. How are you? I'm pretending to be a statue. That's, that, that's actually brilliant. <laughs> it's a good seeing you, finally meeting you guys. Indeed. Um, we actually did interview you, although we weren't there ourselves. I remember, yes. It was yes. <laughs> several months ago. I remember, um, yes. First trip to London? It's my third trip from London. Third trip. Yeah, yeah. It's always in the Victoria area, so I know the area well. But if I go two streets over Buckingham Palace Road, I, I am lost completely. And uh, you get to do any sightseeing while you're here? Yeah, I've seen, uh, I've seen Buckingham Palace. I saw uh, a couple other things. I saw... Uh, the Shakespeare Globe Theater and uh, went to the Tate Modern Gallery thing. So yeah, yeah. And I uh, hope I have some more time this weekend. I hope to go out. Do you hope to uh, pick up any influences and inspiration in London? I thought you were going to say chicks. I'm like, I, I just got married. Uh, any influences from London? Yeah, uh, last time I came, 
um, you know, after seeing a bunch of the sites, and after, especially after going to the Tate Modern, I saw a bunch of like pieces of art that was like, oh, I could do this and this and that, you know, and uh, yeah, so I hope so. We'll see what happens. Cool. Well, we look forward to seeing those videos. Cool. It was uh, nice to meet you in the flesh. You need two explosions. You're gonna explode, it and then you gotta make a noise. Thank you very much. <laughs> Hello, Mike. You featured in our VidCon video, and that was when you were going all the way to LA to see Justine, but now she's here. How do you feel about that? Oh, it feels good. It's nice that she's come over to London to see all her UK fans. So at VidCon, what was it like to actually meet Justine? I mean, how long had you been watching her videos before you got to meet her? I'd been watching her videos for two years, and it was just really nice to meet her and to get to chat to her a bit. Did she recognize you when you met her here today? She did, yeah. How was that? That was nice. When's your next trip to LA, do you think? Probably next year for VidCon. He's going to become a VidCon regular, I think. I hope so, yeah. Hi, this is Alice Afro, those video guys. And Justine, welcome to London. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I'm like so excited to be here. I wanted to ask you, what inspires you to, be, to keep making videos? Oh, there's so many videos every week. It's amazing. All of these people, like all of these people is really what keeps me doing it. You know, getting to like make the videos is one thing, seeing the comments, but coming here and like getting to meet all of these people, like it's, it's unreal. Like it really is awesome. Uh, you making any videos in London? I made a ton, except there's no internet for me. And my, I, my, I can't use my phone half the time, so I've been like, just, I can't post any of them. But they'll be up soon. Thank you very much. And John would like to know, what does he need to do to get a date? You know, you got to send a good tweet, you know. Good tweets. Good tweets. There you go. <laughs> Thank you very much. And Thank nice you. To meet you. Thank you.